Hello guys, how are you doing? Hope you are doing good. This is your Sunil from Indus Valley Ayurvedic Center. Today we are making vegetable dum biryani with the help of Chef Chandu. Come, let's start it. Let me help you with ingredients. Onion, green chili, lemon, fresh mint leaves, tomato, ginger and garlic, carrot, beans, turnip, cilantro, turmeric, garam masala, cumin powder, kashmiri chili powder and fresh coriander powder, ghee, coconut oil, fresh peas and salt for the taste. The proportion we are taking will serve 3 to 4 people. 250 grams of rice, wash it two to three times and leave it in the water for about 15 minutes. This is a special vessel which we usually use for dum biryani. Once the pan is hot, put coconut oil. We are taking coconut oil, you can take any oil which you like, like sunflower oil, any oil. Then put little ghee onto it. Now we can see our ghee is getting melt. So now we can add some spices to it. Fry that a little bit. You can smell the aroma, it's really beautiful. Fry the spices for one minute, then you can add onion. Green chili. And fry this. Fry the onion about four to five minutes until it turn out brown color. As you can see the weather, it's beautiful raining. So we are making dum biryani in a proper timing. As you can see our onions are getting golden brown color. So we taken one measure of ginger garlic paste. After putting ginger garlic paste, fry that for a while so that so the rawness of ginger garlic will go. While frying, you can see it's amazing. Even the aroma is beautiful. Now we can add fresh mint and cilantro. And fry this for a while. Maybe for about a minute. We can add all our vegetable into it, carrot, beans and turnip. You can add cauliflower if you like. We can add fresh peas in this time. Now you can see the vegetable is half a week cooked. You can add tomato to it. Mix it well. After adding tomatoes, now it's time to put all the spices. We can add all Indian spices. We have taken one teaspoon measure, Kashmiri chili powder, 
ఫ్రెష్ కొరియాంటర్ పౌడర్ గరం మసాలా టర్మరిక్ పౌడర్ అండ్ క్యూమన్ పౌడర్ ఆఫ్టర్ యాడింగ్ ఆల్ ద స్పైసెస్ ఫ్రై దిస్ ఫర్ అబౌట్ త్రీ టు ఫోర్ మినిట్స్ సో ఆల్ వెజిటేబుల్ కెన్ గెట్ స్పైసెస్ నౌ యూ కెన్ యాడ్ సాల్ట్ ఫర్ ద టేస్ట్ as we taken one glass of rice we are using two glass of water into it after adding the water wait until it get boiled you can see our previous videos in the indus valley arrows center and let me know how you like it the water is getting boiled it's exact time to put add the rice the rice we kept it for soaking for 15 minutes it's nicely soaked the rice we kept for soaking for 15 minutes you can see it's very nicely soaked you can squeeze some lemon that gives very good taste to the dum biryani As you can see almost the water is drained now you can dum the biryani to make it properly dum you can use any weight on the vessel so the hot air doesn't go anywhere out after lowering the frame you can leave it 10 to 15 minutes so the biryani will be properly done it's almost 10 to 15 minutes now let's see how it comes you can see that it's properly done so it's ready to serve it come really good the taste bud i'll let you know We are so excited to try the biryani. Let's see. That's one of the best biryani I've tried. You guys should make it at home and let me know how you like it in the comment section. Thank you. Chandru, you made the biryani beautiful. Thank you.